good morning students today we are going to discuss about the third chapter the third chapter deals with the switches and relays and pcbs already we know that what are the switches what are the relays and what are the pcbs we having the three topics are there in this chapter today we are going to discuss about the switches today topic is switches so what are the objectives in this chapter what we are going to learn in this chapter the switches are very very important in the day to day life everywhere we use the switches you can see where we are using the switches in the daily life to on the light we use the switch for the mixer we use the switches different types of switches for the vehicle we having the different types of switches and for the anything anything to make the on and off we need to have the switch so today we are going to discuss about the all varieties of switches so our objective is after completion of this topic you will be able to understand and describe and classify the switches what are the switches what are the different types of switches what is a switch we you need to understand you try to remember that you need to grasp that what is a switch and what are the different type of switches next we are go we go to know the working of toggle switch and the specification of toggle switch and the toggle switch applications next switch is the push button switch we are going to this the push button types working specifications and applications we are going to discuss another switch is the rotary switch the rotary switch working specification applications next switch is the slider switch again we try to understand what is a slider switch slider switch working and its specification and its applications at last we try to discuss about the working of keyboard switches keyboard switch specification application of keyboard switch and next we go to discuss about the thumb wheel switch specification of thumb wheel switch application of thumb wheel switch and at last we try to discuss about the symbol of all these switches so this is today our agenda we are going to discuss all these things one by one okay get started are you understanding what i am going to explain we are going to discuss about the switches this definition of the switch types of switches all types we try to know what is the working principle of the switch what is the specification of the switch application of the switch where we are using those switches coming to the main topic define a switch what is the switch you know what is a switch a switch is the button which makes the power on and off it may be different way but the purpose is it allows the power it allows the current and it stop the current that is the main concept of the switch you can say that a switch is a device which can connect two points in a circuit or disconnect two points you know that the switch is connect two points are disconnect the two points connecting whenever it connects we see what happening in the slides uh, we explain detailedly if the switch is acting so 
has to connect two points. It's said to be on position. Whenever it is in the on position, the power is passed through the switch. If the switch is act, uh, acting so as to disconnect two points, it is said to be off position. A switch is an electrical device that can either turn on or turn off a device. You see the figure. What the figure explained that open switch. The thing is that we are applying the voltage supply to the bulb. You see as the switch position indicates that on or off. And see the switch closed the switch closed when the switch is closed the power or the current passes through the switch and makes on of the bulb the first figure shows that the switch is open there is no current flow in the circuit then the bulb does not glow in the figure b you can see that the circuit, the circuit is closed by moving arm and there is a path for the current to flow and bulb glows. Thus, for this kind of switch, there are only two possible states which are on state and off state. The moving arm can be moved to open or close the circuit is called a pole. We can say the switch in terms of the poles, single pole, double pole like that. If the moving arm can be moved to open or closed a circuit is called a pole. The number of poles here are one. And the number of throws here are 1. Number of poles, number of throws are 1. So it is called single pole, single throw, switch, SB, SD. Like this, we use this notation to represent the switch number of poles and the number of throws it having. Now we try to classify the switches. Classification of the switch. You can see there classification of the switch. How we are classifying according to its operation. A switch is classified as following types. The first one is single pole, single throw, switch. That is the contact is one, the throw is one. That's why it is called as a single pole single throw switch as we discussed this is a general switch next one is single pole double throw switch single pole double throw switch the meaning is it having the one contact line and two throws are there that is a two paths are there if you throw first path it will act as a first connection if you throw second path it will having the second path Double pole single throw switch. The meaning is it having the two contacts and the connection is one. Double pole single contact. Double pole double throw switch. Double pole double pole switch. And another one is a multi pole multi throw switch. It having the multiple number of poles are there and multiple throws are there. We discuss all these uh, switches symbols. Once you see that symbols, you may understand uh, what is this pole and this throws. The next we are having the other classification is there. Depending on mechanism of operation. What type of mechanism it is using. Depending on that, switches are classified as Toggle switch, push button switch, slider switch, rotary switch and again we having the lever switch, micro switch, piano switch, 
mercury switch so these are the different type of switches the thing is we are classified these switches operation depending on the mechanism of operation how they are working depending on that we classified the switches already we discussed toggle switch but push button slider switch rotor switch lever switch micro switch piano switch mercury switch all these things are there now we try to discuss one by one what is the mechanism what is going on what is the switch operation we try to discuss first switch is the toggle switch the first one is the toggle switch the toggle switch the toggle switch refers to a type of mechanism made up of two arms almost in line with each other that are connected with a pivot resembling an elbow resembling an elbow just like the elbow we having a one connection is as used in the term toggle switch there is a specific me mechanism that permits a sort of snap like action snap like action as you see in the elbow it moving front and back in the toggle switch the the toggling connection the pivot moves front it provides one path it toggles next side it provides the off condition like that on and off condition is there this may be this you can get the clarity by seeing the diagram you can see the toggle switch how it is just like the elbow it may either move right side or either move the left side depending on that movement the connection will be take place connection will be we are discussing about the toggle switch you can see the toggle switch how it is the construction of the toggle switch is there when the toggle switch it is act as elbow it moves front and back toggle switch how it is working working of of the toggle switch it implies a sliding contact system the sliding contact system is a spring loaded to accelerate the snap action spring loaded moving contact the lever can be moved either side for on and off the lever can be moved uh, either side on or off when lever is operated the flexible arm allows the switch to snap from one state to another state that is on state to off state or off state to on state now you see here the specification of the specification of toggle switch generally specification means we try to know the current rating voltage rating contact materials contact resistance insulation resistance the life span of the switch are called as a specification our toggle switch having the current rating is 1 ampere to 15 amperes voltage rating having 230 volts to 230 volts ac or uh, 12 to 24 dc volts contact materials we are using is non ferrous material and silver alloys contact resistance is 10 milli ohms insulation resistance is 100 mega ohms the life is 100000 operations applications the toggle switch used in domestic applications used in electronic equipment as on or off switch used ion electrical appliances push button switch 
A push button switch is used to either close or open an electrical circuit depending on the application push button switches are used in various applications such as industrial equipment control handles outdoor controls mobile communication te terminals and medical equipment and etc that is the application of the push button a push button switch is used to either close or open open an electrical circuit whenever pushing it will be on in this also different types are there you can see the push button how it is we having the button and contacts are there and spring is there a circular or square shaped button is provided on the front side this is connected to a spring loaded metal bar button is pressed what happens when the button is pressed the button the button bar is moved circuit closed that is when the button is pushed the spring is compressed and it will connect to the contacts 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 you are closed the contacts are made of phosphorus bronze so like this current passes from the first contact to the second contact now we going to see what are the different types of push button switches push button switches are two type push to on push to off push to on on in this we have two types locking non locking the thing is we can lock or non lock push to off here we having the locking and non locking push to on means whenever we push the switch will be on whenever not pushing the switch will be off push to off means already the switch is in the on position whenever you push the switch will be off whenever we switch whenever we push the switch will be off so these are the two two different types of push button push to on push to off push to on means when you here whenever you push that what happens current will be passes push to off means whenever you push the connection will be breaks so that is a connection is there the symbol and circuit of the push to off switch push to on switch is here whenever button is pressed the two contacts will be on whenever button is pressed the two contacts will be opened you can simply easily see that how it is working push to off switch the switch contacts are normally closed already you know are broken when it is pressed when it is pressed the connections are broken you can see the push button how it is whenever pushes it try to do its operation specification already you know what are the specification of the push button voltage rating current ratings and materials and life you see here voltage rating is 125 volts to 300 volts we can use for the push buttons For AC, 24 to 220 volts we use. Current ratings are 3 to 8 amperes. For AC, 2 to 6 amperes for the DC. Materials we use is phosphorus, bronze, and brass. The life is 10 lakhs operations. So this is the. applications where we are using the push button push buttons are used in tv computer cd player as the on off switch used in calling bells used in measuring instruments electrical appliances like mixers power supplies stabilizers and ups like this the push button also important it having its own 
importance is there depending on the application the push buttons are used push button we have the two things push to on push to off the next switch is we are going to discuss about the rotary switch this is the another important switch the rotary switch means it will rotate the the contact will rotate from the one path to another path that's why it is called as a rotary switch a rotary switch is a type of switch that is used on devices which have two or more different states or modes of or modes of operation such as a three speed fan or a cb radio with multiple frequencies of reception or channels that is called as a rotary switch so what is the actual principle of the rotary switch <coughs> The principle of the rotary switch makes or breaks the circuit as it is rotated between the position. The rotary switch makes the connection or breaks the connection and it is rotated between the positions. Now we see here how the rotary switch with one fixed wafer. We have the one fixed wafer and how it is there first you see a switch knob is there insulating ball bearing containing wafer is there and next you see a switch rotating contact is there fixed insulating wafer conducting terminals for connecting wires to switch so this is the rotary switch which we are using switch in position switch between positions this here ball bearing fits in hole between positions ball causes the bending of this wafer you can see the rotary switch we now we seen one slide but is here we have the multiple slides are there multiple connections also there so what is the working of the rotary switch Rotary switch or rotating knob is rotated. Contact moves along strips of conducting material of wafer, and uh, and it makes a connection to these conducting strips. This closed and open the circuit. A rotary switch consisting of a spindle or rotor that has a contact arm or spoke. which projects from its surface like a cam it has an array of terminals arranged in a circle around the rotor around the rotor each of which serve as a contact for the spoke through which any one of a number of different electrical circuit can be connected to the rotor the switch is layered to allow the use of multiple poles each layer is equivalent to one pole usually such a such usually a, such a switch has a dent mechanism so it clicks from one active position to another rather than stalls in an intermediate position makes or breaks circuits as in i see that is a rotary switch the rotary switch generally used there where we are using the rotary switch means the rotary switch wherever the voltage is rotation is needed more ranges are needed we use the rotary switch another switch is there that is called as a slide switches slide switches what is the slide switch slide switch means we can move make or breaks the circuit as a lever is slided between the two position the lever is sliding between the two positions that is you can see 
Slide switches. Slide switches are known for providing selection of two or more switch positions for engagement of respective switch contacts. Electrical slide switches have long been used to control the operation of many devices like volume and other control for audio video equipment. Dimmer circuit or dimmer control for lights among a multitude of other daily electrical products we use the slider switch slide switches providing the selection of two or more switch positions for engagement of respective switch contact what is the principle you can see the slider switch terminals two terminals are there if you move the slider front it having the connection it will move the other another side it having the another connection is there A simple in construction used for low voltage applications. It consists of lever made of insulating material like bakelite. The lever can slide in horizontal direction. Contacts are made with conduction materials like nickel, silver or platinum. You can see the slides which is where we are using. So many ways, so many positions we use them. Slide switches is here. It is the sliding. So the specification of slide switches are voltage rating is six to twenty four volts DC. Current rating is point five amperes. The materials we are using is nickel, silver, platinum. The life expectation is one lakh operations. Applications of the slider switch where we are using you can see these slider switch in the radio and some applications used in tv and radio receivers for band selection used in measuring instruments to select a range of parameters used in amplifiers for selection of options used in digital circuits we are using now we try to discuss about the about the keyboard switches now we are going to discuss about the keyboard switches the keyboard switches <coughs> where we are using the keyboard generally the keyboard switches are used in the computer keyboards laptops and the calculator wherever you are using the keyboards we use these type of switches the keyboard switches are generally four types are there mechanical switches magnetic switches memory and switches capacitive switches are there four type of switches are there mechanical keyboard switch the mechanical keyboard switch is spring loaded contact actually the contact between two plated phosphor branch contacts causing the switching a single keyboard with just 0 to 9 keys can be used for making a selection of any number of combinations you can see the keyboard the different types of keyboards are there keyboard is there that keys are there you can see there magnetic type keyboard uses a magnet and rate switch here we use the magnet and rate switch coming to the membrane keyboard switch it uses a thin acetate membrane and a foil which bends and makes a contact a thin sheet of metal is made of usually phosphorus branch or conductive rubber. This is pressed through a hole in a insulating plastic film. Makes a contact to the bottom PCB or vapor which has a plated around there. So another important one is the capacitive keyboard switch. The capacitive keyboard switch uses 
प्रेस टू मेक ए कैपासीटिव कपलिंग फर् दिग्नल एसी सिग्नल ईज कपलिंग थ्रू वे द स्पाज वेपर प्रेस आन द पीसीबी ट्रैक्स दिस काज इज द कैपासीटिव फीड थ्रू कैपासीटिव कीबोर्ड स्विच इन दिस टाइप ऑफ कीबोर्ड प्रेसिंग द की चेंजेस द कैपासीटेंस ऑफ ए पैटर्न प्रिंटेड आन ए पीसीबी बोर्ड Usually, this permits a pulse or pulse train to be sensed, like dome switch keyboards. The pattern will be covered by a thin insulating film. Capacitive keyboards are inexpensive, resist wear, water, foreign objects, and dirt. They are common in PC keyboard. the pc keyboards which we are using the switches are made with the capacitive type capacitive type now we see the construction of a wheel thumb wheel thumb wheel rotating thumb wheel switch what are the rotating thumb wheel tip you can see thumb wheel switch make or break the circuit as wheel is turned on pcb wafer on the pcb wafer it is uh, act as a wheel depending on the wheel position depending on the wheel position the contact will be established now we see here construction of thumb wheel thumb wheel switch A thumb-operated rotating wheel is present on front. A thumb-operated rotating wheel is presented on in on front. Shows the number as the wheel is turned by hand. Whenever we turn the band, whenever we turn the wheel, it shows the number as the wheel is turned by hand. Wheel rotates on the edge. Numbers appear on a narrow vertical window. Numbers appear on a narrow vertical window. You can see thumb wheel switch. A set of contacts are present on the spring-mounted PCB wafer. PCB wafer is made with nickel over gold plating. Contacts are made of gold-plated beryllium copper. you can see the thumb wheel switch how the thumb wheel mean the mouse we use the thumb wheel as we move the thumb wheel the cursor will be moved you can see rotating knob is rotated this makes a contact with the set of contacts present on the spring mounted pcb the the thumb wheel provides a connection for each of the selected position numbers appear on a narrow vertical window configuration of thumb wheel switch what are the types thumb wheel switches are two types single pole 10 position output switch bcd output switch 10 pole position output switch or bcd output switch single pole 10 position you can see here single pole is there it moves the 10 position depending on the wheel the position says the which contact is on which contact is off can see 10 output connection one common connection bcd switch is here bcd having the five is selected four outputs one common connection four outputs one common connection now we try to discuss the specification of thumb wheel switch voltage rating current rating contact resistance life expectations expectancy 
voltage rating is 30 volts current rating is 1 milliamps to 0 0.1 milliamps contact resistance is less than 0.1 ohm life expectancy is 20,000 operations electrically 30,000 operations mechanically after that we try to replace that wheel thumb wheel application of thumb wheel you can see where we are using this thumb wheel application in test and measuring equipment in instrumentation computer peripherals we are using the we are using the thumb wheel now we are going to discuss about the symbols of the different switches the first switch is push to on now we see here how it is push to on whenever we push the contact will be closed this is called a isa symbols also this is the isa symbol notation when you press that will be connected next one is a push to off is here initially it is connected if you push the contact will be open sliders which you see a single pole double through sliders which already we discussed that the now will be slided between the two contact first contact to second contact that now will be slided so now see here first connected to the first wire if you slide that to the another end it will connect it to the either sides single pole double push push button is another type single pole double through single pole double through so here it is connecting the double lines two lines it is connecting a single pole it connecting the it having the double throw now we having the terminal that is called as a lever type switch here whenever pushes it will contact to the contact to the terminals slider switch the multiple contacts is here multiple slides one two three four five there whenever it pushes it will go slides the between two contacts now we see here simple switch on and off two positions are there single pole double through is here single pole in the middle is there double through means it connect the two double outputs upper one and the lower one otherwise it will be off the switch is here single pole and having the output connection is here there is the two connection you can go for the other one double pole single throw principle double poles are there it will connect it at a time that is called a single throw you can see double pole means we having the two contacts but the pressing is only one that's why it's called a double pole single throw double pole single through is here we having the double poles are there but we can connect separately separately here we can connect them separately and separately here from here to here we can connect here to here next uh, we try to discuss about the double pole double throw principle is a double poles uh, we have double throw is also there we can connect here or there so that it make the four connections double pole double throw double pole is there double throw is there like this we have the two poles here we can throw there four contacts are there whenever it need it will get switch normally open normally open that is whenever close it will be closed so normally close if you push it is open now we see the rotary switch 
how it is single pole three way we having the single pole and three ways are there how it is one contact which connects the first second and third is there next is like this one two three one it is at the first position it's second and third position single pole three way now we having is here single pole five ways five ways are there with the one pole in the middle is there that will be like this we having the five one two three four five single pole seven ways you can see single pole seven ways one pole is there it will connect with the seven different paths one at a time one is you try to remember one at a time first second third fourth like that seven poles are there so these are the symbols we are discussing are discussing once again we try to repeat that single pole seven ways one pole is there it having the seven ways are there next one is single pole five ways are there one pole is there the five connections are there single pole five ways are there rotary switch and uh, single pole three ways we can having the pole one it goes to the three positions like that the normally closed switch symbol it is is normally closing means normally it is the position is closed position whenever you want to make on that is in the off position so these are the different symbols we are using so this is about our topic what we are discussed in today now we try to summarize what we are le- what we learn in the in this class so what we learn is we discussed about the definition of a switch what is a switch switch is nothing but a contact between two points it makes the connection or breaks the connection between the two points we discussed about the figures of the switch on position and off position whenever it is on the connection will be on current will be flows there whenever it is off the switch will be off again we discussed about the classification of the switch according to it operation the switch is operation we discussed and uh, operation single pole single throw single pole double throw double pole double throw double pole single throw and next multi pole single pole multi position like that we discussed about the switches according to its operation after that we classified the switches according to its mecha- mechanism of operation the operation depending on the classification of operation we classified into them push button type rotary button rotary switch sliding switch thumb wheel switch keyboard switch like that we classified so many switches so in the first switch we discussed about the push button switch we discussed about the push button again in the push button two types are there push to on push to off whenever we push if the switch will be on that is called as a push to on whenever we are pushing it will be off that is called as a push to off we discussed and we seen about the diagram and features of the push button switch types so another one we discuss about the construction of slider switch the slider switch switch it makes the connection or breaks the connection while sliding between the two contacts whenever it's sliding between the two contacts it makes the connection generally these switches are used in the these switches are used in the tv applications and radio applications we are using this slider switches and also we discuss about the keyboard switch so different types of keyboard switches are there we already discussed about the mechanical type keyboard and magnetical type 
keyboard metal foil type keyboard and capacitive type keyboards which is we discussed in all these generally for the computer we use the capacitive type keyboards we are using so another one is a thumb wheel switching thumb wheel switch means here we having the whenever we rotating the wheel the switch make the connections number of connections are there in the thumb wheel we discuss about the so many switches that is a single pole three connection single pole seven connection single pole five connections we are used about the thumb wheel switch at last we discuss about the switch symbols different type of symbols so depending on the operation we describe the switches all the switches symbols and symbol connection how we make the switch connection we discuss in the in this period so that we we now we are going to understand what are the different switches what are the mechanisms involved in the switching or switching connections of the electrical switches so many switches are there so many applications are there in the day to day life all switches are connected in depending on their applications whenever we need that type of switch and the switch voltage rating and current rating we should be observed when the rating matches we use that type of switch there now we are going to see some questions to understand the uh, to know the understanding of the switches that is uh, quiz you see it the identify the switch symbol what type of switch it is you see what type of switch it is it is the normally closed switching because already it is closed that way it is called as a normally closed switch the answer is a you can see the symbol you can say that simply normally open you know question normally open now you can see what type of switch is here that is nothing but a rotary switch and it having the single pole seven wheels the answer is b is now we see here that is also a rotary switch single pole five wheels so another question this is a single pole three wheels the answer is b now this what type of switch it is it is a slider switch i think so the answer is d slider switch so to identify the symbol is here what type of switch is there slider switch with multiple contacts you know that the answer is d and the switch symbol is here first two of rotary switch keyboard switch slider switch the answer is push to off button the answer is a this is push to on the answer is c so the switch symbol is this is a normally open switch all we discuss answer is c Okay, answer is. Another one. This is normally closed. Answer is three. So let me discuss. This is the. Uh, now this is the push button, single pole, double throw. The answer is. Now identify this one. Single pole. What type of switch this is? Single pole, double throw. Uh, answer is b a or b b identify the switch symbol single pole the answer is single pole double through now we can see here the answer is you can see the answer what are the answers we try to understand this so these are the different one 
the questions frequently asked are uh, these are the uh, different questions it may useful to know you can see the on the slides the symbols so this is another uh, one it is this is a thumb wheel switch you can identify the answer the next one is the switch what type of switch is here it is the thumb wheel switch this is the what type of switch it is thumb wheel switch is there and this is the this is also thumb wheel switch no this is the bcd switch because the the bcd we having the numbers are there bcd switch has that five number five it having the what is the one two four eight bcd so it having decimal thumb will having the zero to nine And this is the thumb wheel switch decimal and this is the BCD again we have seen this one already we see so these are the other questions you can see other questions thank you for listening this video if you have any doubts you can Ask me, I will clarify you. Thank you.